never knowing who I was But now I can see eternity in my eyes I can see the African in me Don't go on doubting your own blood I can only share what it is with me. You know what I mean? First thing, you know, I can give a recipe. You want the recipe? Because I don't, I don't, I'm not going to say what somebody should do because that's too complex. Everybody's made different. You know what I mean? But I'll give my recipe and then everybody put their own seasoning in there. You know what I'm talking about? First one is it got to be arranged. If the ancestors ain't arranging your marriage, it's not going to stick. If you're arranging your own marriage, it's not going to stick. Firstly. So firstly, you got to sit on the edge of the universe. And accept the fact that you will be loved. You got to sit on the edge of the universe and accept the fact that you will be loved and that you will love somebody like you've never loved before. Like, I'm not talking about love. I'm talking about you're going to love like, like you have to, but you have to sit there, you know? You know, you got to, Kim it! You got to sit there like you, you got to sit on the edge of the universe. And, and, and we know how to do that though, that, you know what I'm saying? We know how to do that. Everybody, especially when we have a hard time, so it probably takes a little bit of tribulation to know what love isn't. Next thing, next thing, you got to realize that your life will not be yours anymore. That you will know that you will no longer belong to yourself. You will belong to the earth. You're going to be ready to accept that there's it's a battlefield. You know, and that your partner in battle will appear for you once you take the first step to show up. You know, you got to put the grease under your eyes. Because if you ain't got the grease under your eyes, I mean, you ain't serious. You know, then when they're there, communicate after, because they will come. They going to come. But once they're there, and how to keep it strong, how to keep it strong, be truthful. Tell your whole entire story. Sing your whole story. Do your cold, you do your own personal cold train. You know what I'm saying? Do your own personal, it could be Muddy Waters, John Lee Hooker. <laughs> But you got to go cold drain on it. You're going to cry telling your whole life. The things that you tried to hide. The things that made you mad. The things that damaged you. All these things. You know? You know? They call that the, the sorrows of all set. You know? You got to go. You got to dig in. Go in. You know? And reveal the ugliness. You know? In your hand to that person. And offer it to them. Offer all the ugly all the ugliest things that make you scared to be a person that's scared to be alive and you offer it to them in your hand and you say here this is this is part of me you know it's basically an excrement like just in your hand and said you know this is my bs i know i have it because in that that is when you start to know yourself you know 
Because a lot of times we hear like, you know, man, know thyself, know thyself, know yourself. And then it's like ego driven and it's like um, something that's romanticized, you know what I mean? But knowing yourself is knowing how you get when you're tired, knowing how you get, you know, when you're combative. That's part of knowing yourself. I don't want to scare people, you know. I know I'm strong. I know I come on strong. I ain't trying to scare nobody, you know. I'm trying to I'm I'm modeling myself after Mother Earth. I'm not that's not my role. I'm not supposed to be scaring people. But if I know I do scare people, that I'm able to do that. That's knowing myself. You know? They gotta put set on the back burner sometimes. Lion goddess can't be on the front burner every time when you feel mad and stuff. That's to the sisters, you know? You know? And to the brothers realize that. You control the direction of the physical things in the house, but you have no control over the emotional tone of the house. She's the chef, you know. She's the emotional. She's the chef of the emotional tone, and there's nothing you can do about it. There's nothing that you can say. There's nothing that you can give her. No, no nothing you go buy her. There's nothing, you know. She's gonna be the chef, you know. So like, either we're gonna be silent in this house, or we're gonna be like, hey, hey, what, what you gonna watch on TV? Yeah, like like for real, and then and then I'll just give you like apart from the esoteric thing, like in a nutshell, it's like if we get mad, you gonna get mad, you gonna get mad, you are gonna be like sick, of you. <laughs> you hear all the time, <laughs> but I don't wanna go nowhere, <laughs> you know. But then it's funny because it'll be like now, like me and Deli, we passed the point of like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It, it was never, we're not like, it's not romance, it's like it's. Romance is like, uh, you know, it's not about romance. It's not about romance. It's about friendship, partnership, you know, warriorship, you know, say, hey, I am here. I'm here for you. I accept you. I when I hand him out my hand to you, full of my poo poo, you say, I love you, you know, so you when you hand me your poo poo, what am I going to do? No, yeah, your poo poo stank. No, I accept you. I don't need no. Don't give me no roses. Give me your poo poo. Roses, really, man. I'm like poo poo poo. You know what I'm saying? Like for the real. But no, but that. I hear you. Yeah, it it got really far. But 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 <laughs> it got really far. But no, but but that's real. Because it's like if you think that you're too good, if you think that you're too good to own up to who you are. You ain't gonna last in no relationship. And this is a song I sung when I knew I was going to sing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mankind is a child of the sun. Mankind is a child of the sun.
Maturity. I earned my own maturity. You know, I wasn't just incubating in a lab. You know what I mean? I wasn't just incubating in a lab. And then like, okay, now I'm 21 and I don't know what's going on. You know, I'm in the world. I'm getting into the world and I'm learning myself. You know, I'm getting into the world. I'm making mistakes. Those mistakes Okay, what do I do with these? How can I make this into music? You know, my music became real. It, didn't be, it just wasn't in the lab, you know? But the thing about it is, I realized if there was something I want to know, I'm going to learn it. And I'm going to study it till I know what, I'm, what it is I want to know. I, I realized that, that it, there's nothing in this world I can't know. There's nothing... Besides the unknown, you know, I'll never know the unknown. You know, I have great respect for the unknown. But I mean, for the things that, for known things that I want to research, I can know them. If I put my time into it, you know? So it's like, it's like I left school to go to school. Like the school that you like have to like die to graduate. <laughs> So, and no, and then like, no, no, just to go to another grade, you know what I'm saying? If there's a harmony, there must be a river, or it's some rain from skies above. Well, there's a harmony, there must be a river, or it's some rain from skies above. Must be a place for the water to go, if it's to be just that. I think the greatest thing is that it gave me permission to be even more raw, you know? Because like, sometimes... I could be in different moods when I'm producing myself and I like have this idea and then I like tracing around this whole little thing, you know what I'm saying? But there it's just like, yo, that's already taken care of. Now just bring it through. What is it that you really like? What What is it? You know what I'm saying? I was real fierce on this record, you know? Like, like the things that are in me that I feel like talking about. Well, to be fair, you know, I do talk about black things all the time, <laughs> you know, saying, to be fair, but to present it in a different way where someone where they might not be um, from a different crowd, you know, and they want to hear that boom bap and stuff, you know what I mean? And also reclaim rhythm and blues, you know? Cause right now it's like R&B, like Wu-Tang rapping, boom, you know. 
It's that Wu-Tang version of R&B right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm, a lady, lady, I'm, I'm not even a man. And I'm not even a woman. I'm singing like the woman sing like the man. And the man sing like a woman. I don't know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? My rings and my chains. And I'm just like this is a woman singing about like. Sound like a man, like a Roman man, like 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 a Greek man. You don't do for me, and do 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 do. Like this sounds like a Greek man. I'm not talking about. I'm not like a like Roman man. This one, I mean Roman Catholic man. I don't know. Anyway, what I guess what I'm saying is the rhythm and blues. You know what I'm saying? Rhythm and blues, like. It became apparent that that's what the art that that's what it was gonna be. You know what I'm saying? If there's songs on there like "Best Love." There's like a song on there that's "Best Love." That's like a straight up R&B song, but it's like being real. Like, I, like, like the, like. It says like, you know, I want to give my best love to you. You know. But I heard they bombing Libya and it put me in a mood. Hear me, you know. Heard they bombing Africa. It put me in a mood. But you and me. We can make a difference, you know, and like you know, you know, you know, I want to give my best. You know, I want to give my best love to you. But what's what going down in the Congo put me in a mood, you know? Seem like everywhere in the world, my dear, there's pain, and it put me in a mood, you know. And then I'm begging, and then I'm begging, dude, for money so I can build a well in Africa. You know, come on, baby, don't be late. Need a well in Africa, babe. <laughs> but like. But that's me that like that's real, you know what I'm saying? And I have never felt like so vulnerable like that's like such a vulnerable song for me. You know what I mean? Like like to beg somebody like help me change the world, like help me. Like I know I'm in a bad mood right now, you know? I know you're not feeling the way I'm walking around this house. You know? You but you know, but but you know. You know what I'm saying? Like like you you know how I feel, you know? But but I can't always express these things. So it's like it's it's real raw. It's real raw, you know what I mean? What we're doing is like to unif to unite through sound, you know? Some other ship is here to unite people through sound. Unite the human collective consciousness. The people who are consciously conscious of themselves <clears throat> the more we be true to ourselves and the people who are being true to themselves we're gonna all meet each other so we're the theme music for that 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 uniting we're the theme music for that uniting this is Georgia of G and D aka Miss One and her ancestral orchestra sending mad love to out the box TV for actually giving a damn about what's important. Thank you so much for y'all time. Much love.